Hi there, this is Tim Grage with Thoughts to Live By. Our verse for today is taken from 1 Samuel chapter 16, verse 23. It says, And it came to pass, when the evil spirit from God was upon Saul, that David took an harp and played with his hand, so Saul was refreshed and was well, and the evil spirit departed from him. That was 1 Samuel chapter 16, verse 23. Saints, it's possible to create an atmosphere around you that's so strong that everywhere you go, things are compelled to respond to you in that light. Note here, it is either you align with whatever is prevalent around you, good or bad, or you carry your own weather conditions with you and force the current atmosphere to align with yours. It is possible to carry such favor on you, for example, that though no one has succeeded in the field, you get there and everything changes. It is possible, for example, to carry such an atmosphere of healing around you and that apart from you being healthy, you get around the sick and they also recover. You can create such an ambience of life around you that even in an accident, no one dies simply because you were there. In our verse above, David gets into the demonic presence of Saul and imposes his own atmosphere. The consequence, the demon leaves Saul and Saul was at peace. Daniel was thrown into a lion's den. He enforced his atmosphere and the lions lost their appetite. We know for a fact that it was Daniel's atmosphere. Why? Because when he, Daniel, was removed and others were thrown in, the lions ate them up. David enforced his atmosphere. Daniel enforced his atmosphere. Don't be at the mercy of your industry or, or, or that prevailing ungodly atmosphere around you. Create your atmosphere and sustain it no matter what. How do you do this? Use your words. Did you get that? Use your words. Words are spiritual and, and the spirit realm is an atmosphere. Let me say that again. Words are spiritual and the spirit realm is an atmosphere. You can enforce your own aura today. Jesus died that you might live so live. Is there sickness? Then declare healing now and keep declaring it. Is there lack? Then declare prosperity now and keep declaring it is there a delay then declare that the siege is broken and your expectation will not be cut off declare it now declare it often declare it daily make your godly climate the dominant one did you get that let me say it again you need to make your godly climate the dominant one stop saying what you have been seeing and start saying what you want to see and trust the word and watch how you will begin to see what you have been saying. Think on it today. Speak your preferred atmosphere as often as possible and watch how others might experience one thing, but you will experience something completely different. I bless you with the blessing of the Lord. This has been Thoughts to Live By with Tim Grange. Bye for now.